Women's History Month is especially important because women bring a much needed perspective to the table. We have traditionally been left out of decision making, we've been left out of positions of leadership, we've been left out of areas in which the decisions made impact our everyday lives. And this month, it's important for us to recognize that when women aren't at the table, you're not getting the full picture and you're certainly not making decisions that are gonna benefit everyone. Being the first South Asian woman elected to city council is overwhelming. It's uh, something that I think about in terms of how exciting it is, but also it's 2021 when this happened and we're just getting the first elected. And that's the balance that I keep close to me as I realize that I'm representing a group of people in Columbia and frankly, South Carolina that haven't been represented in a very, very long time. You know, and I, and I wanted to shed light um, about the South Asian and Asian American community throughout my campaign and even now as your city councilwoman. I want people to understand that there is a diversity in South Carolina and in Columbia. And with that rich diversity comes an opportunity for us to incorporate new ways of doing things. So from, cha from sharing how I pronounce my name correctly to some of the traditions that my family holds, I hope that that inspires young brown girls, brown boys to step up and because they see someone that looks like them and they say, I can do that because I can be that and I can make a difference in my community. That's really what this is all about for me. So I would say that my entire life I've been lucky to be surrounded by women who in different ways have been leaders, whether it's been leaders in our family, leaders in government, leaders at their job, and they've always instilled in me this confidence that it's okay to speak up and cause some trouble. Because the worst thing that happens is you make it easier for people behind you, even if you get in a little bit of trouble. So I would say that my grandma, my nani is what we call it in Hindi, my mom, uh, my, my college professors, uh, women here in South Carolina that have really been behind me every step of the way, making me feel like it's okay when things are not okay is exactly why I am where I am. I know that it can be very scary to make the decision to step up and run for office or to get involved in your community, but know that it's worth it. Don't let anyone make you feel like you're less than or that you're not enough because your perspective is so important, whether it's your lived experiences or what you've been trained in or the customs and traditions that you come from. You are more than enough, you are qualified, step up and do it and make a difference in your community.